Hello YouTube, Warbles on a lot here with the view over the 10 year old boy wall which has just donated about a thousand litres to the 2007 vintage boy wall that's only just been erected. Before I stick a brand new ultraviolet cover on it I just thought it would be interesting to give you a bit of a view of the installation. Because I finished up using a variety of materials to go between the elastic rubberized bottom of the pool and dirt and possible rocks that might stick up into the bottom of the pad. It's not entirely perfectly smooth on the bottom there. Particularly the padding from the old sleeping bag. But uh, on the other hand, it hasn't got a huge amount of water over the top of it. Wait until there's five or six tonnes in there but we have got a lens shaped body of water that's shallow right out at the circumference and about four or five inches deep in the middle so when the brand new 12 foot pool which is currently in this freight pipeline somewhere between Dubbo and here arrives then I will transfer the rest of the water out of the top pool into the bottom pool and then I'll erect the new pool where the top pool stands and I'll wind up with two new 12 foot pools each one of which is good for five and a half thousand litres of storage and that means I might even have enough water stored at the end of a rainy spell to try and cultivate a vegetable garden as well as uh, having twice the resistance to bushfires if I can then get a pump, but you know, that's further down the track. Right at the moment, I've got to stick a ultraviolet cover on it to stop it from evaporating or turning into algae. And of course, when I began the saga of trying to repair the kangaroo bites in the air boom of the old boy wall, I ordered three 12 foot ultraviolet pool covers. So that's easy. I have such a thing. I have one for each pool and I've still got a spare. But I can't quite see the point in fitting a brand new cover to a 10 year old pool that is about to be taken out of service anyway. That one there will do until the new pool comes. And this one will go on there. But I wanted you to be able to see the lenticular puddle of water and once I put the cover on it's not a visible thing and of course I'll have to stick up a rudimentary fence just to keep the critters out warbles on a lot to YouTube ciao